This presentation is about how Steel.js helps make sites load faster. Steel.js speeds up your site by writing module bundles that are optimized for caching and reducing the number of requests needed to load your site. It works great for progressively loaded or statically loaded sites. It does this with a two-pass bundling algorithm that will be described in a moment. But first, let's take 30 seconds to explain the difficulty optimizing production builds within a complex site. This example site has four different pages. Each page's JavaScript and CSS dependencies are listed underneath it. Many sites load each resource individually. Although this allows caching of shared resources like jQuery, it often leads to too many resource requests. Other applications build a single, hopefully minified and gzipped, script to load for each page. This isn't much better because users can't benefit from caching. Resources shared across different pages are duplicated in each build and will be re-downloaded between pages. Finally, tools like RJS and Webpack let you manually specify modules to bundle. For example, jQuery and title CSS are used in every page. You can create a bundle for them and load that cacheable package in each page. This is better, but manual configuration is difficult to optimize as the number of pages and resources grow. For example, caching can be improved by making bundles with modules shared between subsets of pages similar to what's shown here. Steel Tools figures out the best bundles to build for you. It does this by analyzing the dependency graph of your application. It first bundles the modules that are the most shared across all pages. It repeats this process until every module is in a bundle. At this point, every page can load exactly what it needs. And every bundle will be highly cacheable. However, the category page needs to load five bundles where fewer might be faster. Steel.js is able to combine bundles until all pages only need to load a specified number of bundles. If a bundle depth is specified, Steel.js tries different combinations of bundles and picks the combination that adds the least amount of wasted bytes needed to load any page. I'll, I'll explain what this means. In this scenario, it might first try to combine the H plus C bundle with the C plus P bundle. This would result in the home page adding two kilobytes of extra code because it loaded slider JS. But it would also mean that the product page loads 30 kilobytes of extra code because it loads carousel, cart, and can JS. This combination produces a total of 32 kilobytes of waste. Steel will then try combining another two modules, this time C plus P and C plus R. This results in only seven kilobytes of total waste. If this is the smallest combination that reduced the number of bundles category needed to load, this combination would be chosen. Steel.js's bundling algorithm makes highly cacheable and quick loading builds. It can be used on multi-page sites or progressively loaded apps. To build a multi-page site, provide Steel Tools build multiple mains. To build a progressively loaded site, specify the bundle configuration. Thank you for watching this presentation. I hope it sheds some light on how you can use Steel.js to speed up your application load times.